Grunkle Stan, are you wearing a blindfold? <laughs> nah, but with these cataracts, I might as well be. What is that, a woodpecker? Hello, hello, Sag here, coming back at you with another video, and today we're actually going to be playing around with Tiger Woodpecker. Well, mostly Woodpecker, but Tiger comes in a little bit later. So, you know how Woodpecker normally works. You put it at the front, it hits a few of the front units, maybe pops a melon, maybe pops a pepper, potentially even a pizza unit. Um... But I wanted to try something a little bit different with it. I know it's always been possible. You can put it behind your units and uh, hit them as well. So, you know, it works with Triceratops, Blowfish, Camel, uh, the works, anything that has a herd ability. So I was like, you know, let's, let's get something going with that because it is uh, a bit more interesting, I would say, and also a lot harder. I, I didn't think it would be so difficult to to win with woodpecker hitting your own units well it turns out it does a decent bit of damage and you really have to have like um garlic or lemon on those units and you know they normally need to be pretty sizable but i found a i'd say a decent way to to play to play it so it's actually getting this early camel here is really nice actually buy a frigate bird that's crazy. Who has ever seen that unit actually be played? Uh, wild stuff. We pill turtle or uh, pill spider and actually get a camel out of it. We instantly get the level two camel on turn four. That's really, really nice. Um, but yeah, so what we really want to get is a woodpecker. We want to put him up at the front uh, for a little while because we need, first of all, we need both of our hurt units before we can start putting them behind them. And then we also want to get uh, probably a leech. So we, what I, my plan was to put leech behind a camel for, you know, a decent bit of time. Buff up the, the leech quite a bit. And then once the leech gets big enough, actually swap it with the woodpecker. So we can have leech up front now that he's pretty big. And then we can have the woodpecker in the back to actually hit our uh, camel and blowfish. Because that's what we're going for. We're going for blowfish. Uh, we had to do something a bit earlier because I felt that getting uh, camel triceratops wouldn't work very well. Um, you know, you're just only getting stats at that point. I actually thought some snipes would be a little bit better. And also it's a bit easier to find the blowfish. So there we go. We got the blowy here. And then, of course, we need to find our leech. And we can actually have a little bit of a scaler before we get um, our tiger. Because, of course, tiger's tier 6. Anything that late is really hard to, to fit onto the team if we're going to be doing it like this. So I actually have my woodpecker in back. It only does uh, one hit, so it wasn't too, too bad. And it works out pretty well since we already have the level 2 camel. So we're doing that until we can find our leech. There he is. And we'll actually get a little bit of a buff on our peacock, or uh, sorry, on our woodpecker. Uh, we don't, we don't need peacock around here. We got camel. Um, get a little bit of a buff there with the clownfish, and now we can swap the woodpecker to the front and have leech get big while we wait to find the tiger. And you know, this probably would have been pretty good with like a penguin on the team getting a, a level two blowfish, level two camel, level two woodpecker. Um, I just don't find it. <laughs> and you see how strong Woodpecker is up at the front. Like, it's just so much better to have it up at the front. Like, there's never really a reason to put it behind your units other than, I don't know, memeing, which is what I always go for. We even get a pineapple on them, too. So, so now this kind of hurts us a little bit later, as when we do eventually swap it, we are actually going to need... Um, lemon behind these two but for now that's just something i'm gonna have to live with so we come into this first round or sorry now first round um we do hella damage with the the pineapple here and the camel having um garlic is actually really really good for us oh and we even see a lemon here we'll probably get it on the blowfish since we already have garlic on the camel blowfish is doing basically nothing for us right now but we see two monkeys those two monkeys can actually do quite a bit of work for us um, even getting a level 2 would be really nice. Oh, we definitely have to go for a level 3 camel as well. Uh, so we can at least get a few buffs on our woodpecker. That's what we're really trying to do. We're just trying to stay in it as much as we can. So it's really, really nice that we still have 9 hearts, uh, with this build. So when I do eventually swap 
uh, woodpecker out, we don't just immediately uh, lose off of like the first round because as you can see, we are still not that strong. Find another lemon though, and we can get that on our camel right now. Get a little bit of health on everything because that's really, really important. And then we find our last monkey, and maybe when we level it up, we can actually find a tiger with it. That'd be pretty nice, but we, we try to remain hopeful. I mean, just look how much Woodpecker does up at the front. It's just so good. Can actually uh, take out the front units and then have Leech Camel clean up. So we finally get our level 3, and it is actually into the Tiger, which is really, really what we want. But our Leech is still kind of small, so I think we will freeze our Tiger for a bit. Try to go for a level 3 Woodpecker, because we're really close at this point. And then pretty soon we will swap Leech up at the front. Our Woodpecker is getting decently sized to a 1621. That's not bad. Oh god, but he's got his own camel with a lemon. Not very good for us. We just barely win, too. I was really hoping to find a few more Blowfish. Um, but a level 1 honestly does about the same as a level 2. It's only 2 more damage. It's not like I have Pineapple on it or anything. Uh, it's mainly just to, to get some Snipes to hopefully take out some Peppers or some Melons. So when Leech does start fighting, it doesn't uh, like trade Melons. Basically kind of like that. So we should be doing pretty well here. Oh, but he's got a Porcupine. And that's just going to straight up destroy our uh, woodpecker there and we are gonna lose to our to a little t-rex but that's fine we've got one life left i'm totally cool with that and another tiger so we can actually get the level two tiger we can't get it in now um, i want to get at least one more buff and then we can swap the leech out oh okay actually i fucking lied we can swap Leech out now because, of course, Monkey is still going to give it the buff. I totally forgot about it. Monkey still gives that 4-6 buff. It's not 6-6, six, six, but 4-6 is going to have to do it for us. Um, and now with Woodpecker being level 3, look at that. We get a bunch of hits. Didn't take out the Melon like I wanted to. Didn't even take out the Vulture. But we've got a big Blowfish now, a 41-43. Uh, and that's enough to do it for us. Really exciting stuff. Looking at how quickly this blowfish gets up there is absolutely crazy. So now it's going to get even crazier with a level 2 tiger behind it. That is 5 hits that we're getting. So here we go. This is about to be the pop-off. Look at all those hits. And almost an instant 50-50 onto the blowfish. Well, he's close. He's close. But really cool stuff here. I'm really glad that I could pull it off. It was really fun. So thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And you know what? Have a beautiful day.